Rising Mountain Chums, me again today. Today I'm going to go up a very small hill, but an important one called Wansell, just outside of Ambleside. It's turned distinctly autumnal. Ah, it started raining. It's bound to happen sooner or later. I'm still a little optimistic for the day. Bill Burkett is quoted as saying that Wensel Pike is to Ambleside as St Paul's is to London. Quite a popular walk up from Ambleside, so you never need to fear that you might be alone. Aha, I see the footballs. general rule, you should be able most of the time to follow the long line of people walking up the hill. This is not a hill for those seeking solitude, although the views are worth the effort. On Eva. There's not a great risk of getting lost on this hill. Follow the well laid path and you'll be alright. Certainly gets the heart pumping. Wonsell Pike. But the highest part of the hill is actually Baystones, which is where we're heading to now. I think it's probably fair to say that Baystones is a little less visited than Wonsell Pike, although it's got good views of its own, just not a Windermere.
nearly there. Shall we go? we carry on because although that has the can, according to the Ordnance Survey, Bay Stones is actually a little bit further on. So by my calculations this is the summer of Bay Stones. So talk about a peak with full summits. One Sfeld Pike is not the top, the Cairn is not the top, this is the top. So there we go, top of base stones. And to get back, we turn around and do it all over again. people who set out to get to the top of one cell bike actually get to the top of base stones. Not a great number I imagine. Great work for players. Path takes us back to the road, and from there it's an easy walk back into town. Thank you for watching, if indeed you still are. If you've enjoyed this, please like and subscribe, and join us again for another Wainwright walk sometime. Cheers!